That's how it works. Let's get to it. Look at all the sunshine here this morning. This is fantastic, but it's another very chilly start to the day. We're at 25 degrees right now. Now tomorrow morning, we're going to see those temperatures a little closer to freezing to start the day, and then we're going to end up by the time we hit the afternoon into the 40s. So the big thaw starts tomorrow. Today, just mostly cloudy skies by the time we hit the afternoon, but we're going to enjoy some sunshine here first. 20s for the most part west of the Cascades. As we move into the night tonight, we're going to start to see our next system arrive. Uh, that will be bringing some heavier rain and dropping in from uh, the northwest here. Watch as we uh, get into, this is the morning hours, just a few showers up there in Snohomish and King County. The, Olymp the Olympic Peninsula getting hit a little bit harder here to start the day along with the coast. And then the heavy rain starts to move its way a little bit farther inland as we get into the 5 o'clock hour. Notice this of red and yellow, and this is just dumping snow up here in the Cascades. We're going to be seeing tons of snow up in the mountains as well, especially Sunday night and on into Monday. So as far as travel goes over the passes, Monday is going to be a really tough day, especially in the morning and Sunday evening will be really tough up there as well. Bottom line is we're going to be seeing feet of snow coming up here over the next few days up in the mountains. Check this out. This takes us all the way through Thursday, uh, excuse me, Tuesday night. So Tuesday at 11 and our models given us about two to three feet of snow from Stevens Pass down to White Pass. Uh, White Pass we will see a little bit more because the precip's going to be a little bit heavier down there to the south. So a lot of snow coming our way. Here's today's weather for you right around freezing. Once again, we're talking low to mid 30s. Tomorrow we bump all these temperatures up 10 degrees. So back into the mid 40s here for most of us, but it's going to be a stormy day. We're going to be seeing some strong winds at times as well. And with that, the thought begins. Heavy rain with this snow and ice on the ground in the neighborhoods means you need to clear your storm drains. Do that today. Because if you don't, you're going to have some issues with flooding out there on the roads and all that stuff. You don't want that. Monday, showers along with Tuesday and Wednesday. Now, there is a chance any of these days here to see kind of a wintry mix in the morning hours. Uh, but then I, I just don't expect sticking snow here coming up this week. We'll keep a close eye on it. Make sure to uh, pay attention to the forecast as we move into this first work week of the year. And uh, then Thursday and Friday, we're back to a little bit more heavier, steadier rainfall. China.